What I'm going to show you in this tutorial is how to hide a column, a row, tabs, or particular cells within a worksheet. Now there are many reasons you might want to do this. Say for instance you're distributing a worksheet throughout your employees and you either have some data that they shouldn't be viewing, you can hide it, or you don't want them to accidentally delete something. So you just hide that data so that they can't see it. Now I'm going to show you a few different ways on how to hide data. So let's first begin by hiding column C. One way to do that is to click it, go to format, column, and then click hide. And you'll notice that column C is now hidden. Now in order to unhide it, I can go to format, column, unhide, and it comes back. It's worth noting though that if you hide it like this, and I say click a different cell, and then go back up to format, column, unhide, column C is not going to reappear. I have to select columns on either side of the hidden column in order to make that reappear this way. So when I do that, I highlight B and D, go back to format, column, unhide, column C will reappear. Now a little bit quicker way to hide a column is to click it, then right click, go down to hide, and it's hidden. If you want to unhide it this way, simply select the columns B and D, columns on either side of the hidden one, right click, unhide, and then column C comes back. Now the final way that you can hide data by eliminating the column essentially is by clicking to the right of it and dragging it all the way to the left until the width is zero. And then column C is now gone. The way that I can unhide it is have my cursor go to the right of where column C would be, click and drag, and then column C reappears. Now it's worth noting also that when I make column C disappear, all of the data on the chart or graph for column C also disappears. So it's not going to be able to plot hidden data points. Additionally, through this method I can hide multiple columns at once just by clicking to the right and dragging over until two columns have a width of zero. And also you'll notice there's nothing on the graph because all of the points are hidden that would be graphed. To unhide them, simply click to the right and drag. And we'll do it again. And there you go. Now you can also hide rows just like you can hide the columns. It's exactly the same. So if I want to hide column six or row six, go to make it zero and now it's hidden. Unhide, I'm going to select row 5 and 7, right click, unhide. And that's how you can do that. Now if I want to hide particular data points within a worksheet, but I still want them to show up on a graph, and I still want them to be here, what I can do is make them the same color as the background. So for instance, if I want to hide all of this data, I can simply make it white. and now it looks like there's nothing there. So that's a really simple way to hide your data. Now I want it to show up, so I'm going to re-highlight it and make it black. The one thing is to try not to forget where you put the data because if you make it the same color as the background it's very easy to accidentally delete it. The last thing that I'm going to show you about hiding and unhiding is how to hide a worksheet or a tab. So I have three sheets here, and I want to hide sheet two. Now you cannot just right click and hide it. There's no option for that. You have to click the sheet, then go to format, sheet, hide. And now sheet two is gone. So how to make the sheet come back, you can't just select on either side and right click. You have to go back up to format, go to sheet, and then click unhide. Now here, if you have multiple sheets hidden, they're all going to show up here. So you can select which sheet you want to unhide. I want to unhide sheet two, so I'm going to click OK. 
Now if I want to hide multiple sheets at once, say sheet 2 and sheet 3, I'm going to click sheet 2 and then sheet 3. And I did that by pressing control and then clicking both of them. Then I'm going to go to format, sheet, hide. Now it looks like I only have one sheet because sheet 2 and 3 are hidden. To unhide them, format, sheet, unhide. And I can unhide both of them or just one of them. So I only want sheet 2 right now. And there you go. So that's how you can hide your data in Excel and also how you can unhide it. One thing to note, if you've hidden a number of columns and rows and you're not exactly sure where they are, say you have a lot of data, so it's not as simple as missing column C. What you can do is go in the left corner and click select all. Then you can go to format, column, unhide, and do the same with rows. And anything that's hidden that you're not sure about will become unhidden. So that's how you can hide your data in Excel.